Hello, this is PG. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm reviewing Limbs on Steam. The game was developed by Moritz Goldie and Dominic Versch. Limbs is a dexterity based game for one or two players where you control a string puppet in a variety of challenging scenarios. So what is the game like to play? Well, the controls in Limbs are interesting to say the least. You control your character's arms and legs independently. This makes even the most basic things incredibly challenging. Even walking in a straight line can be tough, but also comedy gold. The game is a balance between using either your arms or your legs to navigate the terrain or use items that will unlock the next area. You'll be killing rats in a basement, mixing up a potion for a witch, catching frogs in a net or having a fist fight with other puppets. The levels are split into three acts, with each being uh, fairly bite-sized in nature. It's not the longest game that you'll ever play and I worked my way through it in about 90 minutes or so, maybe 90 minutes to two hours. But despite it being short lived, it is a truly entertaining experience. Due to the game's unique controls, it leads to some of the silliest, most bizarre and also hilarious moments that I've seen in a game. For me, the standout was the hand to hand fight scene in the forest. This has got to be one of the best gaming highlights of my year. Here it is in all its glory. Seconds out, round one. The game does have a two player option with each player controlling one set of limbs, I believe. Um, sadly, I didn't have anyone to play co-op with while I was um, on that day, but I would imagine that's gonna be really challenging and require a lot of teamwork and it should add replay value. So all in all, it's unique, it's innovative, it's very entertaining, but being a small indie, the game did have, you know, some technical problems. There were a few elements in the environment that didn't spawn in, some of the mission texts was overlapped and you couldn't really read it. I did have one crash, but also the game has been updated since I played it. So I hope these issues have been addressed. Now, if the devs are watching this video, please drop a comment just to let us know on those things. Are they fixed or not? Visually, it has a sort of Punch and Judy puppet show type presentation and it works well with each level being like a mini puppet show itself. The characters are nicely detailed. The motion of the characters is also incredibly comical. Um, sound, it's minimal, but it's well suited. It does the job, but it, you know, it's not gonna wow you. Okay, verdict. In an age of tired sequels and bloated open world games, Limbs is a much needed breath of fresh air. It may be short lived, but in the time I played it, I had a massive smile on my face and I would strongly recommend it if you enjoyed Human Fall Flat or Heavenly Bodies. It's got challenging moments, unique ways to solve problems, and some absolutely hilarious fight scenes that you just can't help but find entertaining when you're playing them. It's a big thumbs up from me, and if you need a laugh, Limbs is absolutely something you should look into. Scoring, I would give Limbs an eight out of 10. That was the review, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, like and subscribe. This is PG, signing off, cheers.